Thursday, December 12, 2019, the 12th day of Whiskey Advent with the Scotch Whiskey Advent Calendar 6th edition. What's that going to be, folks? Check it out on the Whiskey Whistle. Frosty the Snowman, my whiskey friends, Mark here at Whiskey Whistle on YouTube, sharing a little whiskey awesomeness from Winnipeg, the center of North America, bringing you the 12th day of the Scotch Whiskey Advent Calendar 6th edition. What is that going to be, folks? Let's get that open and check it out. Where is number 12? There it is. Oh, it's so easy to spot now. It was a little bit tough in the beginning. Oh, and it dropped right in there. Oh, no. Ah, yes. Boom. There. Okay, let's get number 12 out. Easy peasy. There. What do we see there, folks? It looks like it's from Weems, Weems Malts. Pardon me. Let's have a look here. Lord Elko. Elko, E-L-C-H-O. Blended Scotch Whiskey. 60% single grain, 40% single malt. Very interesting. This is really cool. This is 40% ABV. A little on the low side. The cask type is mixed. The cask number is WVM 1028 G and the region is various. Well, I'm certainly intrigued. I've never even heard of this before. We will just get it reviewed and we'll check it out together and I'll let you do the searching for this one just to save a bit of time here. Let's get that open, shall we? Get it poured. That's about half. Have you even heard of this before? This is the first time that this has ever crossed my ears. And I'm very curious. But if that's from Weems Malts, then I'm excited because it's probably going to be decent or better. So let's get into that, shall we? First of all, the color of the whiskey. What do you see there for color? Pretty much you're right up the middle, kind of a middle gold. Yeah, about a 14 karat gold, nice golden hue, dark golden straw. Nice. I would hope that that's natural in color. Let's check the legs out together. 40% ABV, probably not going to be the greatest leg show, but you never know. You just never know. And for a, a, a blended scotch whiskey, 40% malt is big, actually. Okay, here we go. Yep, pretty quick legs. Not bad, though. A little bit on the thin side, so probably a lighter body for this one. Blended Scotch Whiskey. Yes, 40% single malt. That's very big for your basic blended scotch whiskeys. Okay, let's check out the nose together. It's really fresh. A little bit of sherry influence, a little bit of bourbon influence. It is very malty. It's not that um, grain forward. Grain by meaning grain, single grain Scotch whiskey. There is, however, a little bit of um, grain note, as in um, barley and uh, toasted barley, wheat type of a, a, a scent coming through here. Little to no peat. So this is less like, let's say, teachers and more like, let's say, your Grants or your Chivas, which are more like a space side malt. Let's check the palate out. Cheers, everyone. Mmm. Lots of vanilla. Lots of light red fruits. Fresh strawberries. Um, fresh grapes. Mmm. 
red fruits, a little bit of spice. This is not a peated blended Scotch whiskey. Not very dry. The finish is sweet, slightly waxy, fairly long lasting sweet flavors. It reminds me of a better version of Grant's. <laughs> okay, another taste. Hmm. It's really flavorful. It's got that strawberry note. It's got some spice. Spice probably coming from the bourbon. Strawberry com probably coming from the sherry. Good malty tones. Sweet honey. Like table honey. A little bit of sugar syrup. Simple syrup. Hmm. Let's add just a little bit of water and let's see what happens. The nose gets a little bit more ginger, gingery. A little bit different. It's kind of similar though, not that different from the, uh, the neat version. How about uh, the palette with water? Cheers, everyone. Mm. The water really doesn't do anything for the palate. I think neat is the best way to enjoy this Lord Elko, which is pretty nice. And depending on the price, I would probably want to buy a bottle of that to have on hand. I would rank this higher than the Kirkland Signature 80 proof and probably roughly on par with um, hmm roughly on par with teachers for me pretty nice all right well let's get on to the whiskey whistle whiskey score for Lord Elko from Weems Maltz Blended Scotch Whiskey. What's that going to be, folks? That's going to be 81 out of 100. You heard it. 81 out of 100 is the Whiskey Whistle Whiskey score for Lord Elko from Weems Maltz. Day 12 here in the Scotch Whiskey Advent Calendar, 6th edition. Great to have tried that. Really enjoyed it. Thanks a lot, guys. And, uh, folks, if you've been enjoying this, make sure you subscribe to the channel by hitting the link right over here. And hit the bell so you're notified of the future Whiskey Whistles. Ding, ding, ding. And if you've been watching all my content and binging Whiskey Whistle, then jump in and support the channel and become a patron. Patreon.com backslash Whiskey Whistle. Become a Whiskey Whistle crew member. Take care, everybody. We'll see you for the next one. Goodbye now. Mm -hmm.